Next, in Kent, there's an ancient technique being used to look after natural spaces. It involves animals, big and small, including bison that are currently being reintroduced after not being in the UK for thousands of years. Ricky went along to check it out and to try and spot some. So what is so special about the woods here? It looks like any other woods really, doesn't it? Trees, you've got a path here. Well, what is special is that they don't use any kind of machinery or equipment to look after the land here. Instead, they rely on insects and animals to do that job, to try and help all this wildlife to thrive. So Simon, how do all the insects and the animals work together to protect the land? So this is an ancient woodland here at West Blean, which is a really valuable habitat, but we only have about 2% of our ancient woodlands left. 2%? We've lost so much, especially in the last 100 years, through industrialisation, intensification of farming, yeah. developments, increase in population. It's all added pressure. So managing those woodlands appropriately is really important and making sure that ecosystem works together making sure that there's enough insects to feed the birds, uh, enough birds exactly. Talking of insects, I mean, there are so many ants here. I don't think I've ever seen so many ants. So this is one of our wood ants mounds, so one of wood ants nests. So yes, we have lots of these in the woodlands. Quite typical of this type of woodland that we'll find this. Crawling up my leg as well. Uh, yeah, they will crawl everywhere. <laughs> but this is a perfect example of the sort of insects that we have, the invertebrates that we have uh, an ancient woodland like this that help feed the birds that, you know, are part of that ecosystem. And the, the cattle, the other animals breaking up the ground, getting the different age structure coming through. You've got oak trees here, you've got young birch trees, you've got different varieties of species here, hazel, you've got ground flora coming through. You need that management to make all this happen, and the animals allow that to happen. So I mean, here they are. We have found them. Yeah. I don't know if you can see it behind us, but there are two standing up. I can see one chilling out, yeah. <laughs> lying yeah. down. I mean, it's amazing to see, isn't it? Yes. Here in the wild, how brilliant. So here we go, we found the bison. There's five bison here. Uh, we've got the, the bull, the matriarch, uh, two females and the calf as well. So they are all here, but yes, you're right. Even though they're right there in the open space, we can still actually only see three of them. All five are there, but they're just that bit hidden. We've got a pond just over there behind the fence line. And that's why they come over here to have a drink, have a bit of a break from the sun. Oh, it's such a sight, honestly. I'm so glad we finally came across them. Brilliant news. Mm -hmm.